name is Samir Serish. I'm a curator and a gallerist uh, based in Notting Hill. And uh, I've been asked to give a little introduction to the show that you're all attending this evening. Uh, I'm not going to talk so much about the actual exhibition uh, and individual artists. I think uh, we're all in agreement that it's a great show curated by uh, Zina Berkovic. Uh, there are 41 artists in the show and about 80 plus works. So the medium is very, very varied. So uh, I would encourage all of you to make sure that uh, you see all the works and you talk to the artists and definitely talk to the curator uh, because uh, it's important to get the understanding of what the exhibition is about. What I'm going to talk about briefly about the importance of a curator in today's art world. I think as a curator myself, I recently curated a show with 40 plus artists. Um, I feel that uh, Zena's role as an artist and curator is very much as a facilitator, translator and interpreter between the audience and the art world. Um, I had a naked man in my window uh, of the gallery for the last two days and uh, often asked you know, whether we're trying to uh, create a controversy and why we're doing what we're doing. It's, it's more about engaging with the audience. It's very difficult today as an artist, as a curator, as a gallerist to engage with the audience beyond the sort of art circles. And we often work with artists who are art therapists, art educators, and the people that really, really believe in the importance of the art in today's society. I think we can say that uh, without art and artists, uh, we'd be living in a very, very poor society. So more than ever, the importance of artists and curators is, is going to another dimension. And you can see here tonight what Zina has managed to, to create and uh, bring to you from all over the world is, is very, very impressive. The standard of and the quality of art is very high and I think uh, the overall um, sort of an underlining message here, what I particularly liked from her statement was that it's a multicultural corridor. So you have artists from 13 different countries all in a way trying to promote art as a whole and very much trying to sort of use their personal heritage in the spirit of, of, of culture and the sort of uh, engagement and, 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 and collaboration. Yes, I mean the last thing I want to say that obviously art ought to act as a bridge rather than a divider and uh, we see how artists manage to engage with each other all over the world and I think that's something that we learn a day, day out uh, how we could sort of uh, have a lot healthier society. So, without further ado, I'll introduce you to the star of the show, who will tell you a little bit more about uh, why we're here tonight. I am not a star, all the artists are stars. <laughs> uh, dear honorable guests, dear artists, dear friends, welcome to the opening of the Spirit of Art, it's my pleasure and a challenge to initiate and organize the Spirit of Art International Contemporary, Contemporary Art Exhibition. The exhibition is organized to tighten the cultural dialogue between visual arts. Artists come from certain countries, Norway, Israel, Canada, Germany, Switzerland, Australia, France, Italy, United States, Cyprus, Netherlands, Bulgaria, and Great Britain. <laughs> the Spirit of Art presents 81 of the finest work, 60 paintings and 21 sculptures of 41 well-known artists. In the word heart is the word art. This has been my motivation. The bringing artists with their dedication and their struggle for recognition to a place that is recognized and respected. As an artist myself, I know how difficult it is to reach the right public. Here in London, a historic center of culture, I have brought many cultures together. The artists come to describe the world they live in, whether realistic or abstract, in the spirit of art. Artists are the keepers of the dynasty of the world. 
when we, when we look back in the time, we see how the art of each area describes the times in depth, in color, expression, and concept. Artists are an essential part of our society, and they survive by the grace of us who love their works, by their art, and take care of their creativity by giving it a home. <coughs> I hope this, uh, that this event will have an echo and it will create and strengthen links between different countries, different art pe people, and different artists. Special thanks to Israel Embassy and to the Fish Place Restaurant for their contribution to the event. Also, I want to thank to David, to Julia, and to Irene for their help in this uh, project. I want to thank to all the artists for their collaboration in this event and to wish them a lot of success in their art creation. <laughs> I built uh, this project with uh, the help of this uh, uh, wonderful artist and I hope to meet them in another project and I hope that everybody will enjoy in this evening and uh, good luck to everybody. Spirit of Art here in London. Uh, I'm Wilma Veen. I'm from the Netherlands. Uh, it's a privilege for me to be here in London in this nice gallery, and it's all uh, uh, organized by Tina. And she did it very well, and it's a good evening. A lot of people.